What is going on, guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about a recent Q&A that was held on Twitch talking about Splitgate. And the CEO of the company was there talking about a lot of changes and things they're looking to do with the game in the future. And one thing that he mentioned was a future next-gen update. He said the next-gen update was already in the works, but they kind of had to put it on the back burner while they were fixing the server with all the server issues over the last couple weeks. Uh, you know, handling all the, you know, the player load and getting everything running correctly and making the queue times as quick as possible that kind of thing and they have done a great job with it over the last couple of weeks it's a lot easier to get into a game now still a very enjoyable game if you have not played it i would highly recommend you download it and try it uh, there's a huge player base right now on console that we're in the beta version and it seems like that it's not slowing down a lot of people are continuing to play the game daily and a lot of people are still downloading the game daily so it looks like it's gonna uh, keep kind of on this upward trend for a while now but i found it very interesting that they were talking about uh, having a next-gen upgrade already in the works, uh, which is, once again, impressive with this company. I mean, they talked about, you know, how small the company is, how well of it, how good of a job, in my opinion, how well they've done with keeping up with the servers, uh, how good of a job they've done with their anti-cheat. I mean, a company this size is doing things that some AAA companies can't even do. So it's very, very impressive, in my opinion. Now, when he was asked about what the next-gen upgrade version would do, he wouldn't go into great detail. He just said what you would expect from, you know, games out this day and time, you know, what, what, with what all the other companies are kind of doing with next gen. Now I'm playing this, uh, the game you're seeing in the background was played on PS5. Now it does look better. It looks a little sharper, a little crisper, but of course that's really the only advantage right now of the, uh, you know, new gen consoles when it comes to split gate. But it seems in the future, if he's saying, you know, what we can expect from other games uh, out, that are out now, I would assume that means Splitgate's probably going to go to at least 120 FPS if you have the option to play that on your monitor or TV at home. Probably native 4K if you have the option to do that as well. I would assume probably also if you have a 2.1 HDMI, you know, monitor or TV, it would probably allow you to play in native 4K and 120 FPS at the same time. So it looks like we're going to be getting some of those same upgrades that you see with all the other games coming out nowadays uh, that have this graphical upgrade have these you know higher frame upgrade and i think that's going to be great for all new gen players i'm going to have to buy me a new monitor here at some point sadly uh the one i've played on for years is just a 60 hertz so of course you know that was always all we could play on an old gen so i'm gonna have to pick me up a new monitor at some point but i have noticed even these games that have these better frames now it seems most games that i've been playing that run at 60 fps in the past on old gen seem to run a, a more consistent uh, 60 FPS now compared to old gen consoles. So some old gen consoles, sometimes it seems like those frames drop and you don't keep, keep a consist, uh, consistent uh, 60. I think now, no matter really what monitor you're playing on or TV, you're going to at least get a consistent 60 plus, depending on what you have available to you. But I'm really excited to hear that, uh, you know, Splitgate's going to have that next gen upgrade. I was really excited to hear they were already working on it, which was pretty impressive in my opinion. And I think overall the game is very enjoyable. Like I said, if you have not tried it, definitely give it a look. It looks like if you have a new gen console, we're going to be getting a next gen upgrade sooner rather than later. Leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course the affiliate here on the channel, Empire Jerky. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.